Hi, this is George Coghill, and I wanted to share with you a quick vector path creation tip. And this is a way to get real smooth curves in between anchor handles instead of you know dropping the point, dragging your curve out, dragging the curve, then going back and fixing it. I want to show you a way to do this on the fly. It'll make everything a lot smoother and a lot easier. You'll see what I'm doing here. I'm putting I'm treating this line here as one object here, so this V shape here, the sideways V, uh, is one object. So I'm starting here, coming around, back to here, and then there's this shape. But what I've done is I've only created a curve here, or added this in-between point, at the tip of this. And what I'm going to go back and do with the pen tool, click on the path, and you'll see that it has added control handles there, and they've been dragged out, or added at a proper length that's actually a pretty great curve in between those two. I'm going to do the same here and the trick is to kind of, this, this isn't a uniform so I kind of look at the area down here and look at about the, the midway point area wise not not length wise which is I'd say is about right there. Add that handle in there, drag it up and it's usually a pretty good approximation of where, oops, where you need to go. And then the same for this path here. You know, follow this down where it's going to end. I'll close it off. And then I'll go back here. Drag that up. Same thing here. Look at the area down here. And the pen tool. Pull it up. You can see that's that's pretty much what I want it to be. It was a first try without having to re-drag any handles or, or, or tweak anything.